Wow. That's impressive. That's annoying. Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to Cop Drop Productions. In this week's video, I got sick and tired of waiting for the flat to be done to start doing stuff to the shed. So, we're gonna start doing stuff to the shed. Now I know the timing's a bit weird because in the last video I literally just said that I was going to start the build on the E36 and in the video before that I said I was going to start pulling down the Stagia to build the Black 32. But let's be real, I can't do that without a shed and without access to tools and without a dry place, consistently dry place and lit place to, uh, to, to do either of those things. So the first sort of step in starting any kind of build on any kind of car is to get this shed sorted out. So the only reason we actually haven't done anything to the 32 or actually started pulling down the Stagia or even started working on the E36 is for one simple reason. I haven't been able to work in the shed because we've been doing up the flat that's past that door. Go back a couple of videos and you'll see a brief sort of introduction to that. It's taken longer than I wanted it to. So in the meantime, I'm gonna just clean up the shed, at least half of it. And, uh, get back into some actual work on cars, get into the building and get into actually enjoying my cars again. And here's a quick update in the flat that nobody asked for. This area looks no different to how it was before. This is, uh, let's not talk about it. And the bedroom, well, the bedroom is actually kind of, um, kind of the only good portion at the moment. Yeah, ignore the roof. The roof hasn't been painted yet, or this side has. But this, this portion hasn't. But look at the walls. Yeah. And lack of window frame, but we'll do, yeah. It's a work in progress. Like I said, it's taking longer than I thought it would have. Anyway, taking a lot longer than I would have liked and cause I'm an impatient motherfucker, I'm gonna start doing stuff to the shed now because that actually gets me excited. Let's get into it. Let's, I don't know what we're gonna do, but we're gonna do something. Probably just start with cleaning it. Yep. use this someday when I have a car worth cleaning. We've got some spears mate. FD <laughs> and uh, right in the middle of working on it, it uh, pissed oil all over spanner holder. I don't know what else you call this. And um, well, I mean, the upside is none of my spanners are gonna rust anytime soon. Downside is anytime I go to use any one of these, if I continue to use this, these are gonna be covered in oil. I might just chuck this out, or well, maybe we could hang it up and it'll eventually dry itself out. Let's just do that. Let's pretend like it'll get better. I think that's pretty much as clean as I can get it. So this space is obviously a hell of a lot more usable now, which is fucking dope. Oh yeah, by the way, this is um, this is Dante. He don't move much. Anyway, yeah, I can actually walk to the cupboard, look at the list to remind myself all the crap I have to do. Look at shiny tools. Yep, yep. Yeah, just don't look over here. I mean, um, yeah, stoked. Now I can move this car in and out, put other cars in and out of here. That is a toilet, yes. Um, work on this car and or other cars. So long as I maintain this half of the shed to this state or various varieties of this state, I should be able to start working on cars again before we finish the stinky flight. Sick. Anyway guys, that's unfortunately all we have time for this week. I am super keen to say that next week we're going to be jumping into some longer content, some better content. Going to be working on the E36 and, sorry, driving the E36 and doing a bit of work on the 32, hence why I wanted to clean this up this week. Unfortunately, all I had time to do this week rather than install the new bits I've got for the 32, so I thought I'd 
do a bit of a clean up so that next week I've got more time to actually just work on the car, film that, and then jump in the E36 and have some fun in the streets. Anyway, that's it for this week. Hope you have enjoyed. If you have, leave a like down below, leave a comment telling me what you think, and if you haven't done already, hit that subscribe button, and I'll catch you next week's video. Bye. Oh, you don't tie, mate. You don't, mate. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Darn it.